Hey all, I'm Lina Prabhu Pradhi, strategist, spiritual and mental health coach, Amazon number one best-selling author, certified past life regression therapist. I am super excited to meet with you today. I want to tell you a story. You know what? Since many months I've been getting this inner call or outer call, I don't know where this call is coming from. And this call is telling me to connect with a star seed. A star seed is somebody who is from another star or another planet and has come down and been born on earth with a specific mission or a purpose. So this call has been telling me to communicate with a star seed, take him or her on a regression journey, connect them with the star or the planet that they belong to and communicate with the people over there, with the beings over there and find out more about their planet and why is it that they have sent this star seed to earth what is their mission what do they want us to learn why are they here you know we are all curious so um i guess the star seeds want this story to be told and that is why they have been communicating with me so i'm super excited one of the star seeds has volunteered to undergo this regression by me and connect with their star or their planet and uh, there's a lot of uh, information that we got and I'm going to have to break it down into different parts, like part one and God knows how many more parts and present it to you. I hope you uh, learn something from this. Your curiosity is awakened. If you are a starseed and you want to share your story and um, or want to know more about it, do communicate with me. And uh, now I'm going to um, connect with you with the, the audio of our uh, regression with this super fabulous star seed who has who happens to be from palladium enjoy i see earth okay huge earth okay what else What else do you see besides the earth? Nothing. It's like as if I'm looking at earth. That's it from the space. Okay. Right which front of earth. That's it. Okay. Which part of earth are you seeing? Like I'm seeing water bodies. Water bodies. Okay. Like outside view. Okay. I don't know how to describe it, but that's it. Like the maps. Yeah. Like? Like there's this wall and then there is like maps, like a globe. Like a globe. But not exactly a globe. Like, it's very different. Okay. What color glow is this? This is like deep dark blue. Deep? Dark blue. Dark blue. Okay, wonderful. Now, I want you to turn away from the earth's and look into the deep space. Have you turned away from the earth? Look into deep space. 
turn your vision to the star or the planet or the galaxy where you have come from. I feel it's very far away. Okay. Okay. You are now going to reach it faster than the speed of light. At the count of three, you will have reached your destination in the outer space. Ready? One, two, and three. You're speeding up, speeding up, going fast and fast and fast. And at the count of three, you will have now reached your destination, your hometown, where you have come from. One, two, and three. Where have you reached? What do you see, sense or perceive? There is nothing. Where have you reached? Describe what you're surrounding. like a starry surroundings all dark and now I can see many different colored planets yeah different colored planets I'm just floating there standing floating yeah I'm still in like the outer space okay but i can see various sizes of the planets some are like pink or rust rust colored okay some smaller ones yeah but i'm just there nobody's around okay now you are going to get a sense a feeling or a, an indication to glow, go closer to one of these planets. Hone in on this feeling or sense. You feel that you are being called in a direction. Follow that call.
Palladian. That's the name coming to my mind. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Go towards Palladian. Is it far from where you are right now? Uh, it's right there. Okay. Can you describe the Palladian, please? It's very far away from Earth. Okay. There are these bunch of like a galaxy. Yeah. Bunch of planets in a galaxy where this okay. is. Okay. And I don't know. I'm just right there. I'm not able to go anywhere. Not even enter. That's okay. We will enter shortly. What is the color of Palladian? Like orangish, rust pink. Uh, very... Like the surface is not smooth. The surface is like little. Like embossed. Okay. That's what it is. Yeah. Okay. Um, Just circle around. Is it a planet or a star? It's a planet. Okay. Just circle around Palladium for a bit and uh, get an overview of what Palladium is about. Are there any trees? Are, is there water? Is there wind, air? There is air, wind. Yeah. I'm I'm inside. Yeah. Inside where? Inside this this planet. You're, you're on the planet, you're, you've yeah, the, uh, landed the next, on the... next vision is that I'm inside this. Yeah. Inside a cave or uh, on the planet? Have you landed on, on the planet? On, on the planet. Okay, you've landed on the planet. Okay, look at your feet down and look at the earth, look at the ground. Uh, sorry, look at the ground of Palladium. How does it feel? It's soft. It's like, you know, I haven't, uh, uh, I can't, like, like how on earth we touch the ground when we stand. I'm a okay. little bit floating, okay. a little bit above. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Can you bend down and uh, take the whatever, some part of palladium in your hand just to get a feel of the texture of this planet? Yeah, there is grass, different grass. Okay. What is different? Like it's feather soft. 
uh, also very very fluorescent green in color yeah okay what else do you see Nothing. I'm just happy. Okay. So, um, can you now look down? You're floating. So, look down at your feet and uh, describe your feet to me. How do you see perceive yourself on palladium? I don't know, I'm trying to stand and somehow I feel as if I'm in a hammock sort of thing. So just going up. Okay. You're like, um, Boots, like closed, closed, closed shoes sort of thing. Okay, okay. What are the shoes, boots made of? I don't know. Okay, so go a little bit higher and uh, try to take a look at your skin. Touch your skin and what do you feel when you touch your skin? It's like very soft, thin, glowing okay. skin. Glowing, okay. Mm -hmm. What color glow is it? Like that sparkling silver. Okay. Now go a bit higher up and take a look at yourself. Examine yourself. Your arms, fingers. Do you have any of those? Your chest, your face. I feel the eyes are very different. Rest. This is also a little different. But limbs and everything, it's like human form. Okay. With hairs too. Long hairs. Okay. Describe the, your eyes to me. I feel like as if it's like a black like a glowing black dot globes so sort of thing yeah globes uh -huh. not close the shine uh, shiny shiny okay mm -hmm. what color is the shine like within black there is like a twinkle right yeah 
but eyes are not like human form that's like how we have now it, it doesn't feel like that one okay so what is the shape can you around only round do you have eyelids can't see no eyelids or oh, you have it's there yeah it's there yeah you have eyelids fine are you wearing any clothes mm. can you describe the clothes i feel i have two clothes one is like a a robe that i wear when i'm not doing anything mm -hmm. and then i have a sparkly silver with a like a deep red sort of a thing uh like a suit like okay. a full body suit like that okay very different stretchy material it feels okay. on the skin yeah okay are you a male or a female i am a female okay what is your name Kaha something? Ka? I'm not getting it completely. So the letters will magically appear in front of your eyes. The letters which spell out your name. Your vision is getting clearer and you can now sense your name for the alphabets and the letters have appeared in front of your eyes. Kari. Ari. I think this is my nickname, but I have another, like, a long name, but Kari. Yeah. How do you Kari. spell it? K. K A R I Kari. Kari. Okay. Okay, Kari. How old are you? Twenty-eight, twenty-nine. Twenty-eight, twenty-nine. Okay. Now, move around a little bit and see if there is a sign of another life. If there are some other beings of your kind over there. By the way, what what would you call yourself? What species would you call yourself? I don't know, I'm getting a lot of headache. Okay. Relax, 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 relax. The headache is flowing down your feet, from your head, down your body, through the feet, and into the ground of palladium. Allow it to flow down your body into the surface of palladium and allow it to enrich 
the grounds of palladium. As your headache eases out and you feel more comfortable, relaxed. How are you feeling now? Better. Better? Wonderful. Would you like to proceed? Mm. Okay. So what is the name of the species that you belong to? Don't know. Okay, no worries. Float around a little bit around the planet and look for others of your kind, for other life forms. Is there anybody else other than you on this planet? No. Oh. Okay. Who is it? I see people there, like in the gardens, in the fields, like they're there. Okay. There are a lot of, a uh, lot of like, uh, Animals or insects? Insects. 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 Yeah. insects in the sense like the butterflies and yeah, I mean they they all are like uh, very fluorescent kinds, like animated. You know, like it feels they are like <laughs> they are like that. Um, okay, I'm looking like from in high aerial view. Okay. I can see, yeah, like that. It's a vast space. Okay. Are you seeing any other beings of your kind? Yeah. Go towards them. What do you see? Can you describe the scenario to me? They are like my friends. Okay. I think my full name is Kari Mishi. Kari Mishi. Yeah. Okay. Now... Everyone is in a different, different attire. Can you describe the attire? Like um, robes or gown kinds. Uh, purple, green. Okay. How do they look? Like me. Sorry. They look like me. Which is how? Are, are they tall or are they short? Mm, Can they you describe? All are like uh, pretty much same height. Yeah. What is the height? What do you think would be the height of you all? Six feet. Sorry? Six feet. Six feet? Okay. Mm -hmm. Are all of you about six feet? No, some are little 
shorter. Okay. Yeah. So is this your community or your village or your home? It's my home, like home planet. Yes, home planet. In your home planet, do you where do you live? Where do you where is your home? Your family, friends. Are you with them now? Just with friends. Sorry? Just with friends right now. Okay, so can you describe the whole scenario to me? Is it like, um, are they primitive people? Are you a primitive people? Are you advanced no, people? No, this looks like a very advanced, like a very advanced place. It's, it's, it's different than Earth. Okay. In what way? Like the landscape is different. Uh, the trees, the grass. Uh, it's different. In what way would you say it is different? The landscape is different. The yeah, it's it's very different. Like if I look at horizon, it's like a lot of light and yeah, lots of light and clouds and it's a very different space. Is it sunlight or is it moonlight? It's, it's, it's sunlight. Okay, it's daytime over there. Okay. So, uh, what are your friends doing? Can you identify any any friend or go and chat with one friend? Go and say hi. I could see them, but now it's not there. They are not there. Okay. I am standing looking at the horizon. Okay. And it feels like I, I, I go on missions to other planets. Okay. Mm. Mm. I go on missions to other planets. What is your mission? I... To help. To help. Oh. Sur survival. Survival. That's the thing. I'm. I don't know. Now it all looks like a different landscape. It looks like a very rocky and dry landscape where I am. Okay. Mm. What are you doing over there? I don't know. Even the sky is very different. Now it's like uh, like orange. Yeah, orange and white. I yeah. I don't know why I'm, I'm standing there. That's it. You're still on palladium, right? Mm. 
ओके ओके और राइट ओके व्हाट व्हाट आर यू ब्रीदिंग इन टू सर्वाइव एंड ब्रीदिंग आउट व्हाट आर यू ब्रीदिंग इन एंड ब्रीदिंग आउट I don't know why nitrogen is coming in my mind. Okay. I yeah, I don't know. But it's just nitrogen that's coming in my mind. So you're breathing in nitrogen or you're breathing it out? Breathing it out, I believe. I don't know for sure. Okay, fine. All right. So, are you still floating uh, a little bit higher than the ground, or are you are your feet firmly on the ground? No, right now it's firmly on the ground. Okay. All right. Are you alone? Hmm. Okay. So, uh, where is your house? Can you go towards your house on? this planet hmm. i used to come to see sunset that's where i was oh. so now the sun has set now you can head back to your house Are you there at your house? Do you have a house? Mm -hmm. Okay. Are you there at your house? Mm -hmm. Can you describe how it looks? from the outside it's like this like little on a height on a single story like uh, yeah uh, looks like made of like uh, rocks rocks in the sense like cut in a rock yeah inside a rock hmm but like not like medieval kinds it's nice there is light and then and then then nothing fancy inside <laughs> Okay. Yeah. So how is the house built? Is it like how it is built on earth or is it built in a there, different way? And, and it's it's like um, like it has a gazebo sort of thing and then and then you can go in. Okay. And uh cement colored it feels yeah okay what is inside it's nice it's it huh. it's looks like yeah it feels very advanced but yeah but still basic like in what way do you feel it is advanced like i've never seen a house made like that yeah so can you describe it further please 
what is making it know, unique i'm i'm just standing out there and no why am i not going in okay are you still outside the house hmm okay now are there any steps to go inside the house you're walking towards the door is there a door Is there a door to the house? Mm. Okay. Now I want you to stand right in front of the house. The door of the house. Are you there? Yeah. Okay. Now at your eye level... A year, which year is this will magically appear? A number will magically appear on the door. Which is the year that you are in? 16, 15? Sorry? 1615. 1615. Okay. And below 1615, another number will emerge which tells you the distance of palladium from Earth. How many light years is palladium away from Earth? Six five eight seven five eight eight five eight. These are the th three things that. Are coming five to eight mind. seven six five eight seven five eight eight five eight. Okay, These are the good. three things come three things coming to my mind. I'm not sure which one. Okay, I'm and going to read. Yeah. Go ahead. Some some unit of measurement, but I don't know what it is. Take a look at it, the unit of measurement. That's too difficult. Okay. So I'm going to repeat the numbers again. 587-658-758. Am I correct? I think you are. Okay. Now... Are these numbers, is this the distance from Palladium and Earth? Pardon? I don't know why I'm having a shooting pain in my eye. Okay. All right. So relax, 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 relax. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Allow this pain to drain down from your eye, left eye. It's going down, down, down through your neck, through your torso, into your leg and down into the earth. Down into the grounds of palladium. 
it's flowing down it's flowing down and the pressure on your eye is easing out the pain is going down it's flowing down and palladium ground is getting soaked with the pain sensation and it is converting it into a nice rich loving manure for palladium and your pain has dissolved it has dissolved and you're feeling relaxed and calm and peaceful and pain free if you are if the pain has vanished let me know hmm. feeling better hmm. if you are tired we can discontinue and we can continue at another date hmm. i would prefer that you want to discontinue now yeah yeah okay fine wonderful uh relax relax take one nice look around tell the door of your house that you will be back soon to meet more people more of your kind and to gain more knowledge but right now you have to go back to earth so bid goodbye and feel yourself withdraw from the surface of the earth being drawn towards feel yourself withdraw from the surface of palladium as the earth your mother earth exerts its magnetic pull on you and you are feeling being drawn back towards the gravitational pull of earth hi So how do you feel? Good. I don't know why I was having so much of pain. That's okay. Now it's there. Is it gone? The pain has gone. A uh, considerably. Yeah, it just went away. But then it started in another this thing, but never happened before. That's okay. The you know the the travel that you did and the scenario that you saw, maybe that became a bit. heavy on you and that was an indication for us to take a break don't worry about it it will ease out it will ease out it will ease out so how are you feeling how was the trip it was very fascinating yeah and when you were asking even before you said that the earth's magnetic pull will pull you back i was already feeling that pull coming out from there uh that sunset view was also very nice i don't know it it just kept coming again and again very different terrain house i could see i just don't know why i could not enter i was seeing it 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 is it was like a cemented uh, uh, place that, that that's what, that's what i saw and automatic doors i couldn't say but it felt like it had automatic doors though it couldn't open and uh yeah so when when we do our next session i will uh, have you enter the house and we will go step by step and explore because we are exploring right mm. your where you have come from so slowly slowly we'll take it so every step that we take we will mm. try to find out because it's a new planet we are discovering a new planet through you mm. so we will we will pretend that we are scientists or we are explorers and astronomers and we will hmm. see how this palladium pans out hmm yeah feeling good 
yeah definitely <laughs> okay all right very then. very different vision <laughs> Yeah. But it was not coming जैसे पास्ट लाइफ में एकदम फटाफट आता है ना ये बहुत धीरे धीरे आ रहा था लाइक 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 वेन यू रिक्रेस्ट वो अर्थ के व्यू से भी द नेक्स्ट व्यू टुक सम टाइम इट वॉज ऑल ब्लैंक एंड देन इट केम अप दैट एरिया राइट वेर आई सो दैट प्लान बाहर एंड एवरीथिंग इट टुक अ लॉट ऑफ टाइम इट वॉज नॉट कमिंग वेरी फास्ट या आई थिंक बिकॉज यू आर ट्रेवलिंग टू दैट distance mm. Mm. so uh, maybe that's why you saw blackness but when as soon as you approached uh the the planet mm. then you could see it so there was a time lapse mm. because you were traveling mm-hmm. in real time yeah <laughs> but it was very interesting anything specific that really stood out to you uh what stood out to me was uh, first of all the terrain of the place never had seen that ever in my life the view from that of those planets also when i was out and you were asking how do they look out kabhi never ever seen in, like koi sky fi movie bhi nahi i i don't have no interest in them but then husband ke sath jo ek had bar dekhi never even saw those things uh the skin the way it was glowing was also different and that clothes were also very different the material felt very different uh of one thing and uh in general there is like a lot of happiness and i was when i was there with the friends also mujhe aise na communication nahi laga like as if like um, like the words like how you and i speak aisa mehsoos nahi hua aisa kuch hai um uh, or maybe i didn't focus much so that was it okay. i did see myself in like amongst uh, certain group of people beings huh yeah group of beings and that's it but the kind of terrain and the whole uh, the light that comes and all it was very very different extremely different okay did you feel at home over there did it oh, yes. feel yes yes okay what was that feeling can you elaborate on that feeling it was like at content like this is my place sort of thing na no? that that you have so there was a lot of happiness in the heart well okay that's all what right. i felt all right so uh, if you so we will shut down now the this session mm-hmm. and uh, as we, uh, we progress today tomorrow whatever thing you feel that you need to write down and note it down whatever mm. any more information you get uh, the, if there is any download of anything mm. you know just note it down and in our next session we will talk about it sure okay so i'm going to turn off the uh, recording